Yes, the shooting outside of Whitmer, the Whit Whitmer Central Catholic football game last Friday, it continues to be on people's minds. Chase Bachman talked with a Toledo native and parent of one of Central Catholic's standout players who shared his thoughts about the violence tonight. Chase, what did he tell you? Mel and Jeff, Terry Alls has been a part of the Toledo community a long time. His son plays on the Central Catholic team and says when the shooting started Friday night, his first priority was making sure he got off the field. Terry Alls grew up in Toledo and says the city has changed in his time, but that doesn't mean it's a place you can't raise your family. We've harped on stopping the gun violence here in, in, in the city and in our state uh, and in our country. So, I mean, we, we have to do a better job of that. It doesn't mean that Toledo's left, less safe than any, any other city. It really doesn't. Alls wants to give credit to both Whitmer and Central Catholic for their quick response. He says the schools handled it about as well as anyone could in that situation. The collaboration on that was absolutely fantastic. They did a really good job making sure everybody was safe. Today, Mayor Wade Kapsikavich emphasizing the number of guns making incidents like Fridays all too common. We are the only country on planet Earth where these kinds of events happen with any regularity. And that is at least one of the reasons is because we are the only country on Earth where there are more guns than human beings. We're the only one. All says incidents like the one Friday are scary, but says it doesn't change the way he looks at high school sporting events. I don't think anybody should feel like, well, they can't go to a high school game, a basketball game, or football game, or soccer game uh, in the area because Toledo is a really good place to live. And now, Alls says the conversation too often has veered into criticism of the city and the school districts. Alls wanted to reemphasize he thought both school districts did things as best they could. Reporting live in downtown Toledo, Chase Bachman, WTOL 11.